welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new vlog today we are in my hotel room in Dusseldorf Germany I'm going to spend here two nights and three days and I'm going to scroll the city we're gonna go shopping I'm going to go eating I'm going to meet some friends and I want to take you with me and show you everything that I do in this city but first I want to show you my hotel room I'm staying on a hotel called Leonardo Royal. maybe you heard about it is a very international hotel it is on many cities across the world and you're going to get to see this room so before i make a big mess in this room this is the room this is very small but it's very comfortable and has everything that i need it even has a desk which is where i was sitting um to work <laughs> yeah i brought my computer because uh, if i'm here in the evening or something like that then i can edit my videos and we have a big screen television i have some water the phone to contact them i guess and the reception then this is the decoration they have a big picture of the bridge in the rhine river which is the river here in dusseldorf and this is the bed it has a big bed nice decoration everything in white which i like and here is another chair but it has a big window and a lot of light comes in as you can see and what you see outside is just buildings we are in a big city so that's what you see around and yeah Ooh, i kick my camera with the with the glass but yes here they have a coffee machine with some coffees and goodies and there's a fridge but it's empty the, the mini bar is completely empty this is the comfort room and there is some some space to put your stuff i already hung some things and oh and there is the safe okay and this way we have a large mirror yeah <laughs> this is my outfit from traveling i was driving all the time and this is what i was wearing and when i got out of the car then i had a blazer you will see it later because i'm gonna wear this same outfit and i'm gonna go scrolling on the city and here we have the bathroom which has a large mirror the light is very yellow and here you are have a hair dryer and um, another small mirror and some towels here are some goodies like shampoo and conditioner shower gel and some other stuff and that is the shower there are some towels shower toilet and here is the name leonardo it looks very nice downstairs and i will show you later but yeah this is the room i am very happy to spend three days in this room they give me a refreshing welcome from the hotel and it's water yeah you can see a refreshing welcome from leonardo hotels for free <laughs> salute
Beautiful. As I said, I'm still looking for my perfect bag. <laughs> These are beautiful. I just finished my breakfast and I came upstairs to put a little bit of lipstick I am going to show you my outfit of the day I'm going to put lipstick my perfume of the day and then we're gonna head out after that I want to do my nails because it's very cheap <laughs> well affordable here in Germany more affordable than in Luxembourg so I am going to do that. I'm going to do my nails. After that, we're going to go shopping. I want to buy a perfume and I need a few things from Sephora. And I am going to scroll around the shops and see what I can find. Yesterday, I had so much fun. I look on all those shops, as you could see in the video before. I found a bag that I fell in love with, which is the horse bead from Gucci. I... I really love it and it's convertible so you can wear it on the shoulder and also as a crossbody. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to get ready and then we go. guys I am ready and I want to show you my outfit of the day is this turtleneck from another stories my necklaces are from Ana Luisa from a collaboration that I did with them and my blazer is also a wool blazer from another stories my leggings are from top shop boots are from another stories <laughs> and then I have my speedy bandolier size 30 and this is my outfit. I am feeling very comfortable and very elegant, which I like. I am going to also use my Ray-Ban convertible, which is, are these ones, folding Ray-Ban. This is how it's called. <laughs> and let's go.
hotel from Sephora and I bought quite a few things that I want to show you on this big bag. The bag is bigger than what I bought because I only bought a few items. First, I have here the glycolic acid 7% toning solution from The Ordinary. This guys is helping me a lot with my pigmentation and I combine this with alpha arbutin and I use this in the evenings and this is really helping a lot. For everywhere that you feel like you need to make your skin a little bit more clear, get rid of the pigmentation, this will help. And it's like a toning solution I really like this product. This is my second bottle and it is helping. So here it is from The Ordinary. And what I like from ordi The Ordinary products is that they are so inexpensive, but they work. They really do the job. And that's what we all want, right? <laughs> and I also bought a lipstick as the one I'm wearing. This one is from NARS and it's called Mysterious Red and I am not such a fan of red colors but this one is really very nice Mysterious Red from NARS beautiful also for dark skin it's really nice as you can see <laughs> okay so what else I bought I bought a perfume and it's called Libre. Probably you heard of this perfume, which is very popular right now and it smells wonderful, guys. I decided to take only the Libre because they had it also on sale, the small size. This is 30 ml and this is smells really, oh, really good guys i i am in love with this one <laughs> so i'm going to use this bottle and if i like it very much then i will buy a bigger bottle but now it's okay and the next item is a uh, foundation this is huda beauty four filter luminous matte this is a very very popular foundation i always have to buy two foundations which is 310 and 340 because i have to mix these ones i mix them to get to my color my shade because otherwise they are or too dark or too light baklava 340g and amaretti 310g g stands for golden so you can mix them and they will much perfect but yeah this is all what i bought from sephora i am very happy with my ordinary um glycolic acid solution what is this paper so guys i'm going to rest a little bit and then i am going to get ready because i want to go out for dinner this is my last evening here in dusseldorf it has been a lovely time i have pain on my feet from walking you guys i could not find anything that i wanted to buy like really special i saw this gucci bag the horse beat i really like it but it's something i have to think about before i buy it as you all know i am looking for the perfect bag perfect right now is my speedy 30 but this is the bag i take when i'm traveling so this is what i did i am going to rest a little bit then i am going to get ready i am planning to wear some a mini skirt perhaps i keep this turtleneck but i will show you my outfit later on hi guys here i want to show you my evening outfit i am wearing this mini skirt from another stories i really love it it's really cute has here a pocket and I am wearing the same turtleneck with um, my necklaces. I'm wearing my red lipstick. And guys, I'm sorry for the light. It's very bad light here. But you more or less can see. Oh, by the way, I am wearing sneakers. And I get to be comfortable while going for a walk. And as you can see, I now added a blazer. This black blazer is also from Anoti Stories. So my whole outfit is from Anoti Stories. The skirt, the 
turtleneck and the place and my sneakers are from new balance and okay guys so the ties i am wearing are the ones with fleece because it's still very cold in here and then on top i'm wearing some very thin ties and that keeps me warm and then i am going to use my new perfume from saint laurent which is libre this is a very nice perfume the smell is wonderful oh i cannot stop putting it on i really love it and it smells really good it's fantastic and then i am going to use my pochette accessoire louis vuitton is this one and this is the finished outfit how does it look <laughs> i am only gonna go for dinner and i want to be comfortable because of the pain on my feet and i think this this is okay it's friday night so i want to be relaxed it's still elegant on top <laughs> So guys, I am getting very hungry and I have to leave right now. guys it is saturday and i am going to take you with me to a big tower we are going to climb in there i think they have an elevator <laughs> but it's going to be very very nice view we are going to see it i show you it's here it's called the rhine turm that means the rhine tower rhine is the name of the river here in dusseldorf and i am in the parking place and i am going to walk there so guys now i'm waiting for an elevator and it's gonna take me up there <laughs> it's very exciting and here is like the start of the tower and they have all kind of maps and it's this the time of every country around the world the big bigger cities that's what I see. So guys, once in the elevator, I could see that there are 168 floors, theoretically speaking. This tower is 240.5 meters high, which is 789 feet. At the top of the tower, they have a restaurant where I had a drink, but you can eat and drink anything you want in that restaurant. This tower rotates around its own axis once every 72 minutes and the price to enter is 9 euros per adult. It was a great experience and something really nice to do if you are visiting the beautiful city of Dusseldorf. Thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you like my video and hope to see you on the next one.